Welcome to the political classroom. In today's episode, we will unravel the political philosophy of John Locke. Locke's ideas have had a profound impact on the development of modern political thought, so let's dive in and explore the significance and relevance of his philosophy. John Locke was a 17th century English philosopher who laid the foundations for liberal political thought. His ideas challenged the prevailing notions of absolute monarchy and divine right. Locke's philosophy revolved around concepts such as natural rights, social contract, and limited government. Let's explore these key ideas in more detail. One of the fundamental concepts in Locke's philosophy is the state of nature. Locke envisioned a hypothetical scenario where individuals exist without a formal government. In this state, individuals have natural rights but may also face challenges such as the absence of a central authority to enforce and protect those rights. The state of nature serves as a starting point for understanding the need for government and the social contract. Central to Locke's philosophy are the principles of natural rights. According to Locke, all individuals possess inherent and inalienable rights, including life, liberty, and property. These rights are not granted by governments but are derived from our nature as human beings. Locke argued that governments are formed to protect these rights and that it is the duty of the state to secure and uphold them. In the state of nature, individuals have natural rights to life, liberty, and property. However, the absence of a formal government can lead to challenges in enforcing and protecting these rights. To overcome this, individuals agree to surrender certain freedoms and establish a government that will ensure the security and preservation of the natural rights. The social contract represents a mutual agreement between individuals and the government. Individuals consent to be governed and abide by the laws and regulations set forth by the government. In return, the government is entrusted with the responsibility of safeguarding the rights and interests of the citizens. It's important to note that this contract is not a one-sided imposition but a voluntary agreement entered into by free individuals. The legitimacy of the government derives from the consent of the governed, and if a government fails to uphold its end of the social contract, individuals have the right to challenge or even replace it. Locke's theory of the social contract was groundbreaking at the time, as it challenged the prevailing belief in divine right monarchy. It emphasized the importance of consent, individual rights, and the accountability of governments to their citizens. Locke's ideas would go on to influence the development of liberal democracy and constitutional governance. By establishing a social contract, individuals establish a framework for a functioning society where their rights are protected and where government power is limited and accountable. This concept remains relevant today as we discuss the balance between individual freedom and collective responsibility in modern democratic societies. In short, the concept of the social contract in John Locke's political philosophy highlights the voluntary agreement between individuals and the government to establish a just and functioning society. Through this contract, individuals surrender certain freedoms in exchange for the security and benefits provided by a well-governed society. Locke advocated for the concept of limited government, in which the powers of the state are constrained by law and the consent of the governed. He argued that governments should have limited authority and be accountable to the people they govern. Locke believed that if a government oversteps its bounds or violates the natural rights of its citizens, the people have the right to resist and even replace that government. The political philosophy of John Locke has had a profound impact on the development of modern democratic societies. His ideas provided the intellectual framework for concepts such as individual rights, rule of law, and constitutional governance. Locke's philosophy influenced the American founding fathers, who incorporated many of his principles into the United States Constitution, shaping the foundation of American democracy. Thank you for joining us on this episode of The Political Classroom. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more thought-provoking discussions on politics and political philosophy.